Hello everybody and welcome back to the Cool Tech Channel. In today's video I want to cover a very disturbing and annoying error message that uh, drove me absolutely crazy. <laughs> so I thought I'd share with you how I fixed it. Um, in case you run into it, you have a fix. Now I can't guarantee this is going to work every time, but it's definitely, definitely worth a try because I spent many hours troubleshooting it. I mean, I've seen this error over the years many, many times, but I feel like this solution that I found, um, was able to use, uh, is pretty effective and better than most of what I've seen or did over the years. So it's when you try to add a new Outlook profile or email and you get this nasty and annoying message that basically says this, an encrypted connection to your mail server is not available. Click next to attempt using an unencrypted connection. So if this happens, here's what you should do or try. I'm going to walk you through the motions and everything here so you can actually see it happening in real time. What's going to happen is it's going to go, let me just enter this email address so I can replicate this error in front of you and show you exactly how I was able to overcome this. All right, so after painfully waiting for like a minute or so, <laughs> This annoying message comes up, and here's what I did to fix it. So instead of telling it to go next again, it's going to attempt to do the same thing, and it's going to throw that same error message again, and it's going to be like an endless loop like that, a very annoying one. So just go next, or cancel, sorry. Don't do next. Do cancel. And then it's going to ask you if you do not want to create a profile at all, click cancel, or if you want to create. So I'm going to just tell it to create a profile anyway. So once I do that, so I just created a profile anyway, even though I wasn't able to add the email. And here's, watch what's going to happen now. So I'm going to pick that profile I created, and I'm going to click OK. And then, bear with me because sometimes this stuff takes a few seconds to propagate or populate. So, so here now I'm going to go and enter the email address that I attempted earlier. And as you saw, we got that error message earlier. It didn't work for me. So I'm going to do it this way now. Let's wait for it to add. Patient, patiently waiting. And then enter the password again. And it should work. I tested this on multiple emails that I was able to replicate this problem on. And basically, once you uh, you just let it create the profile anyway, and once you let it create the profile, and then you go in and you do it this way, uh, usually it works or it should work. So you see, there you go. Account successfully added. So give it a try, guys. Give it a try. So. Like I said, I can't guarantee that it's going to work every time, but definitely, definitely worth a try. I hope this was beneficial. Uh, please subscribe to my channel. And until I see you in my next video, take care, everybody. Bye.